Quit hovering. You're gonna make people nervous. You got an appointment? Cause if not, consider this area reserved. Only when I meet someone for the first time. I like to meet strangers in public for safety reasons. I'm sure you get it. So why not in my favorite bar? Wow, nice to meet you too. Good thing you aren't with marketing. I've written up a program just for the occasion, but as Ryujin knows, it's yours for either a price or a favor. And should he? Nothing's for free, you know. Cost is a given. A pleasure, as always. Your job is simple. Just run. You got an appointment. Oh yeah, Dalton's lip. I've written up. Oh, I'm pretty sure it's not. <laughs> A break in neon. I don't think so. I get the feeling you're trying to stiff me. I suppose you're not wrong. Maybe I could be a little more reasonable on that price. All right, you win. No wonder Ryujin hired you. While you're snooping around in the tower, I just need you to hit up one more workstation on the way. It's Camden Cho's. Just run the same program on the slate I'll give you, and you're good. It's that simple. That's between me and another client. But you can bet if someone wants something in old Camden, it's not because they like him. Let's just say, it's nothing beyond something that Ryujin would do to anyone else. It seems prudent to focus on one thing at a time, and not become entangled in other matters. Suit yourself. So why don't we get back to that payment? While you're snooping it's Camden Cho. I believe this Camden Cho might consider it a problem, but it is your decision. I hoped you'd see it that way. Like I said with Camden, all you've got to do is run this little beauty on a Laro Chen's computer, and the program will take care of the rest. Once you're done, bring the slate back to me at my place. Whatever encryption Alaru has is bound to take some real work, more than my little setup here can handle. It's nice to see you know more than just sneaking around and talking a good game. Here's the slate. I'll be waiting. Break it open. Neon's the only place where my talents are actually respected. So, you made it. Guess Ryujin's security really is slipping. No one will ever take down Ryujin. It's a credit cash for Bayou. If anyone wanted to take down Ryujin, it'd take more money than anyone's willing to pay. Otherwise, Bayou would never allow it. Now, I'll take that program back that I gave you, and let's give the data a look. I hope for all that was necessary in acquiring it. This data finally reveals some answers.
The program I gave you to run on Ularu's computer basically opens an all-access back door for me. I can see everything and anything, so let's take a look. First, I'll just save off Mr. Cho's info. My client will very much appreciate that. Now on to Ms. Chen. Ularu has some impressive encryption on her files. Not that I can't crack it, of course. Circumventing protections, running decryption. This should just take a moment now. Damn, I'm good. That went faster than I thought. I'm saving several files to a slate for Dalton, including access history and anything related to Project Dominion. Adding in new encryption for him as well, so he's the only one that can view these. And done. You're all set. I've got the new encrypted slate. Let me tell you, it looks like fun times ahead for Ryujin. Technically, I'm not supposed to look, but it's kind of hard to not see what's going on while running all my software. Since you came through on your end, let's just say that slate isn't going to paint the best picture for Ms. Imogene Salzo. But bear in mind, you're dealing with some pretty talented people when it comes to falsifying information. Of course she can't. As much as corps love their field ops, they're never fully trusted. That's why Ryujin probably has you under surveillance half the time, right? Here's the slate. As usual, always a pleasure doing business with Ryujin. I hope you realize what your negligence has cost this company. Your orders were to incapacitate or evade security, not go on a killing spree. Touché. At least we've established we're both failures. Now, let's see what sort of data was worth the lives you took. Someone's been accessing Ularu's files remotely. It's quite a complicated trace, too. I'm impressed Nyx was able to track all of this. Damn. And there's our culprit. Imogene Salzo, senior operations specialist, and one of the few I had in mind for who could pull this off. She has the means, and access. But things are rarely so cut and dry. 
I imagine that constantly worrying about who can be trusted, who is telling the truth, takes quite a toll on everyone who works here. Well, before we make any harsh decisions, I'll need to question her myself. I want you to head to her office and escort her here. We have to make sure she doesn't try anything before I have a chance to speak with her. Good. When you're dealing with corporate workers, discerning the truth from the lies is the hardest part. taking you down for questioning. Nice try, but the building is off limits. Pretty sure that I'm starting. You might be. I hear you. Look, I'll try. Stop running if you know what's good for you! Is it done? It seems your time spent in the tower didn't go so well. Our legal team is taking care of the deceased. I only hope you got the data Nix needed. It will be handled once this mess is cleared up. Now, let's see what we have here. have the files. Well, I assume success is in order. I had a few reports, but at least nothing that set off any red flags. It will be handled once this mess. Now, 